Hi, I'm Eric Kunz with Furuno. And today I'd like to introduce you to a brand new software update for our TZ Touch 3 MFD line called version 3.5. 3.5 includes a greatly enhanced track capability as well as a new reorganized edge swipe up menu and a revolutionary new feature for our DFF3D customers called Follow It. It also includes some other enhancements. Let's take a closer look at 3.5. Version 3.5's revolutionary new follow-up feature allows DFF3D customers to leverage their PBG data to create a constant depth route. You'll see that if I edge swipe up and turn on the follow-up feature, it'll create a white constant depth line from my PBG data. You'll see that if I touch the white line, a contextual menu will appear that allows me to select follow it. As soon as I do that, a constant depth route will be created and I can send that to my autopilot to automatically have my boat follow that constant depth line all the way around a ridge or anywhere where you want to maintain a constant depth. Follow its unique ability to create a constant depth route from your PBG data allows you to maintain your bait at the same level without having to adjust your reel. It's really important for following a ridge or a trough and keeping your bait in an area where the fish are to catch more fish. We've also updated and improved our edge swipe up menu so that it's organized in a more clear fashion with tabs. For example, the main chart menu on the edge swipe up menu contains the main chart functionality, but there's also an overlays tab where you can go to turn on your radar overlay, for example, or your satellite photos, or your AIS or ARPA targets. The great thing is we've also applied the same edge swipe up organization to our sensors, such as our radar, fish finder, and even the DFF3D. For example, if I edge swipe down and select my fish finder, and then edge swipe up, you'll see that the most commonly used selections are instantly available, such as gain and frequencies. However, if I touch the overlay tab, the lesser used selections are become available, such as background color or even interference rejection. This makes organization much easier on the water. And I can even swipe back and forth between tabs to make usage even easier on the water. With this software release, we've greatly enhanced the track feature and functionality. For example, we've added 300% more track memory to TZ Touch 3. You can also save, sort, and name individual tracks. For example, if I touch a track line, I can bring up the track contextual menu and then touch the name box to name the track on the fly. And because now the tracks are individual, we've added them to the list category. So if I go into my lists, you'll see I have a dedicated track category that shows individual tracks. I can sort them by range, length, the duration of the track, the color, name, or date. You'll see there's a search so I can search for the tracks easily and I can edit individual tracks. I can also replay tracks with this new software functionality. So it's really nice and allows you to categorize and really use your tracks more effectively. In addition to those great new features, with 3.5 we've also added some other small enhancements. For example, in the instrument page, you can now go to a solid black background. With before, we just had a carbon fiber background selection. Now you can select either carbon or black. It's really pretty nice and looks pretty cool. Further, we've allowed you to reduce the point sizes even smaller than they were in the past. They've always been adjustable, but now we've reduced the minimum point size so that it's even smaller. To do that, you just go in to the settings menu, go to points and boundaries, and now you can reduce the point size even smaller. That makes it pretty small. And if you want to make them even smaller yet, you can change the point style from modern to classic, which removes the outer ring around the outside of the point. So that's pretty small. You can make them very small. It really cleans up a given area if you have a lot of points in that area. In addition to those minor feature enhancements, we've also made the AIS contacts brighter for better nighttime viewability. And if you have a Wi-Fi connection with your TZ Touch 3 MFD, you can take advantage of the automatic software update feature. 
just check the software by going into settings, going into general, swipe up to the check for software update tab and click on it. If you have a connection, it will automatically download and update your TZ Touch 3 MFD to the latest 3.5 software. For more information about the 3.5 update, go to FarunoUSA.com.